The world of transport is changing. Alternative energies are being developed and electric vehicles are on the rise. Let's get a better understanding of what an electric vehicle is. This vehicle has an electric engine powered by a battery used as an energy tank. Commercial vehicles, buses, scooters and even bikes. For every vehicle, there's an electric alternative. It's a booming market. For example, in Europe, it's estimated that by 2025, one out of every 20 vehicles on the road will be electric, compared to just one out of every 200 currently. The advantages? They include no exhaust fumes, no greenhouse gases or pollutants, quieter engines, and lower running costs. They currently have autonomy levels ranging from 150 to 400 kilometers. These vehicles are designed for short to medium distance trips in towns and the countryside. Where do drivers charge their electric vehicles? Mainly at home or at work, where charging can be left to run as a background task. But you can also charge in public spaces, in town or at service stations for longer trips that require recharging. Where does Total stand? In France, Belgium, and soon even further afield, Total offers its clients a comprehensive range of solutions, green electricity, vehicle charge points, mobile charging cards to be used on the road on public charge points, including at service stations, and a smart billing system. In towns and cities, Total Fuels and Euro Traffic cards give users access to Europe's largest public charging terminal network. Total is aiming to fit its service stations on major highways with super-fast charging terminals, 150 kilowatts minimum. So now you know more about this alternative energy, electromobility, one of Total's development priorities and the way forward to achieve our ambition of becoming the responsible energy major.